Hi guys, World Rated Super Middleweight here, Jade Mitchell, a part of Team Everlast and here at Everlast today to teach you how to wrap your hands. Okay, today the wrap we're going for is a nice simple wrap, all of you should be able to do it, no worries at all. Okay, so the first step of course is we hook the loop over our thumb, like so, the seam down. You can go either way, you can come around the bottom of the wrist or you can go around the top of your wrist, either way doesn't matter. Today. I'm going to come around the bottom of my wrist, okay? So like so, a few laps, we're coming down about four inches down our wrist. Now notice, as, as I'm wrapping my hands, I'm applying a little bit of pressure. Not so much that I'm cutting off the circulation, but our wrap is still tight and firm, okay? So that's important. So not too tight, not too loose, all right? Naturally, there's elasticity in these Everlast bandages. So they will tighten up as you go, so like I said, not too tight. As we work back up, we want to come up towards the thumb. We're going to go over the top of the thumb, like so, and we're going to come around underneath the thumb, like so. Okay, so this is what we've got. That's how it looks for now. So I've secured the thumb. Now when we come back around, we're going to go over the top of the thumb, and then come back down under the thumb, like so. Now we're going to come up and wrap around our knuckles, still applying a little bit of pressure but not too much pressure. Notice I've kept my fingers apart, I don't have my fingers together like that, so my fingers are apart, okay? So we're nice and tight around our hand with our fingers apart. Now what we want to do that our fingers are spread apart, bring the bandage underneath the thumb back through the fingers, like so. You can start at either end of your hand as long as we go through each of the fingers and under through the thumb. So we bring it back around under through the thumb now. We've got the bandage through each of our fingers. We come back around and wrap the knuckles two or three more times to secure the bandage. We're now going to travel back down towards our wrist to finalise and secure our wrap. We velcro it off and there you have it guys, a nice simple way to wrap your hands.